everyone. Have you ever wondered how plants grow? You know, like the tall tree you might climb or the beautiful flowers in gardens. Today, we're going to explore how plants grow. Spoiler alert, it's pretty amazing. It all starts with a tiny seed. That little seed, even smaller than your fingernail, has everything it needs to grow into a big plant. Inside the seed, there's an embryo, a baby plant, and some stored food that helps it get started. It's like nature's ultimate survival kit. Seeds are really special because they contain everything the plant needs to start growing, just waiting for the right conditions. But how does this tiny seed grow into a big plant? Step one is called germination. Germination is when the seed absorbs water and wakes up to start growing. Before anything happens though, it needs water. Water is super important because it activates the enzymes in the seed that start the growth process. Once it absorbs enough water, the seed's outer shell breaks open. Pop! Out comes a tiny root called the radical. The radical's main job is to find more water and nutrients in the soil. It acts like the plant's explorer, searching for everything the plant needs underground. Did you know that roots also help keep the plant stable? They anchor it in the soil so it doesn't fall over. Plants need sunlight to grow, but they don't eat dirt like some people might think. No! Plants don't eat dirt! Instead, they make their own food in a really cool way. This is where sunlight becomes super important. Get ready for some plant science. Once the plant shoot breaks through the ground and the leaves open up, it's ready for photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is how plants make their own food using sunlight, water, and carbon dioxide from the air. Photosynthesis is like magic because it turns things that aren't food, like light and air, into something the plant can use to grow. The leaves absorb sunlight and take in carbon dioxide from the air. Water comes up from the roots. The leaves work like little factories, using all these ingredients to make glucose a type of sugar that gives the plant energy. This sugar is not like the candy we eat, but it's energy-packed food that helps the plant grow. Fun fact, the green color of leaves comes from a pigment called chlorophyll, which is what helps plants absorb sunlight. Did you know that the main material that makes plants grow bigger is carbon, which comes from the air. Plants literally grow by pulling carbon dioxide out of thin air and turning it into solid plant material. So, what do plants need to grow? They need water to help them absorb nutrients sunlight to make energy through photosynthesis, carbon dioxide from the air, nutrients from the soil. Now it's time for some fun facts about plants. Fun fact number one. Did you know that sunflowers follow the sun across the sky? During the day, they turn their heads to face the sun. This is called heliotropism and it helps them get as much sunlight as possible. At night, they turn back to face east, ready for the sunrise. Fun fact number two. Not all plants just use photosynthesis. Some, like the Venus flytrap, also catch and eat insects. These carnivorous plants have adapted to survive in soil. 
that doesn't have enough nutrients by eating bugs. They trap insects in their leaves and break them down for extra food. So, the next time you see a tree or a flower, remember that it all started with a tiny seed, some water, and lots of sunlight. Plants are like nature's superheroes, growing and making our world a better place. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you loved exploring with me, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more adventures. See you next time!